Well, look what showed up on the Chevy farm. If I'm not mistaken, that's an Oldsmobile Cutlass convertible. Looks like a pretty decent car. Rag top, soft top, whatever you want to call her. The top looks good. You can got bucket seats in it. Looks like a pretty clean old automobile. 1972. Supposed to give it the once over because the owner wants to take it for a road trip. He wants to drive down Route 66. It's like a real clean car. Interior looks nice and clean. Got that white and tear. Some people don't like white and tears, but I like white and tear. White and black two tone looks good. Not sure if this is 100% original, but it has 94,818 miles on it. You don't see too many in this kind of shape. I say it's got bucket seats console auto on the floor. Don't have no tilt wheel though. We'll back here. Car cover for it. Back seat looks real nice. I don't know if this is all original or it's been recovered. This fella said he bought the car from his brother. He said he bought it new. So it could be all original. There's buttons on the back up here. I think it was down there. See these little lights trying to come out. I'll better leave that alone before I break it. <laughs> also looks like you might even have the convertible boot back down in there. Yeah. Anyways. We're going to have to give her the once over so you can take it for a long drive. But in the shape of it, I guess he drove it out here. I don't know how many miles he drove it out to here? 30, 40 miles? Made it. One last little look at her. Yeah, pretty blue. I don't know if that's original or not. It does look like it's been painted once to me, maybe. At least in a couple spots. You can see a little overspray. I told him he probably needs some new tires because I don't know how old those tires are. If it was nicer, right? We could put the top down and go cruising. If we could afford the gas for it. I guess while we're looking at it, we'll have a look see under the hood. See what she's got. Looks real clean under here too. One thing I noticed, it's got these paint marks on the firewall. I assume those are original. Don't know why they wouldn't be. Looks like somebody might have put a new fuel pump on it. Definitely has a new radiator, one of those plastic radiators, aluminum, which I don't think much of. That might be new because I don't think that's original. I might be wrong. But new battery. Does have a 350 in it. I can't remember what it has for heads on it. Sevens. So it looks like it has down there. There's a number right down there. Looks like a seven. I don't know what that is laying there, but got a piece of plastic for something. Guess it shouldn't even be on there. It might be a clip. There it is. It's a clip out of there. That clippy clip's no good. I'll just set it right there for now. Here's a two barrel. 
You might not be able to see it, but... Like I said, I'll have to give her the one so it's got points in it. Like something you could do to upgrade it, put HEI in it. Not the points are bad, but sometimes they do cause you a little more problems. And trying to get a good set of points anymore is probably about like finding gold. It means everything's made in China and maybe you can't even get a set of points right now. Yeah, well, yeah, I'll play musical cars here and get this in the shop and get up on the lift and start checking her out, see if there's anything majorly wrong with it. <laughs>